celebrating the, ho the holidays. Fun, festive, but there can be some hidden dangers for our furry friends. Um, trees, treats, you need to make sure that your pets are staying safe. So joining me now, Dr. Christian Broadhurst from the Clay Humane Society. You got a, a frisky little friend over here. What, yeah. what did you say that? This is Yoda. And Yoda? He, he's a bit of a pistol. He's, right? he's our foster kitten at the moment, and he's oh, a Yoda, bit of an Star evil Wars. genius. <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> but yes, he's he's bad. He's very bad. He keeps eating the microphone, which is oh, not nice. Here we go again. It's not polite. Don't no, do it. Oh, there, there, yep. Oh. There he went. Sorry. I think I just bought a microphone. <laughs> Come here, Yoda. Come here. Go visit. Oh, wise one you are. Okay. Okay, so so we want to talk about. I'm sorry, I'm so distracted. No, it's fine. I'm like a squirrel, cat, whatever. Okay, so let's talk about the. How, first of all, you were just saying. Do you have the tree and the decorations up at your house? We or? do. The decorations started about like three feet off the ground and go up yes. from there. Even so, that is not cat safe. Uh, so, so what's Yoda? What, what's Yoda up to? Oh, badness. Yeah. He's, yeah. So he's very much into exploring and checking out the ornaments. And so it's always important, especially with little kittens, mm -hmm. puppies, and even older dogs, just to be aware of what they're doing in the house. You know, don't let them alone with the lights you know, to chew on the light cords or yep. drink out of the water because. A lot of the chemicals that people put in to keep their trees mm -hmm. live um, can be toxic to animals. Yeah. So, what do you guys do at your house that we should not, or, or what don't you do, and what do you do? We should, you know, same things like at our house. So, like, what, what should I be leaving off of my tree? What should I be, you know, as far as far as under the tree? You were mentioning um, when it comes to the. He's okay, crazy. You know what? Yeah. He's I'm, a live wire. <laughs> When it, when it comes to the it, you know the the um, the water and everything under the tree, that's something that you know I typically would not think about. But if they get under there and start drinking that water, I mean that could be toxic. Absolutely. Um, if it, some of the chemicals, some of the preservatives yeah. are not good for animals, but also if you leave the water in there for for three or four weeks, you know it's going to grow some bacteria and some algae and all all sorts of bad stuff. Um, certainly, a tree skirt will help keep animals out. Also, um, exercise pens or baby gates around the bottom of the tree. Can help keep critters out of there. But that's not going to keep that cat off your tree. No, mostly it's <laughs> keeping him under observation. Yes. Yeah, so okay. when he is unsupervised, not giving him access to the Christmas tree. Okay. So another thing is, um, I have received so far, I've received two giant plants mm -hmm. as, <laughs> as gifts. And one I gave away, and then another one came to the house. And, you know, and I'm doing my best to keep them out of the you know, area where the dogs are. Absolutely. Um, but, but, you know, what can we do as far as that? And which ones are toxic to animals? Oh, well, unfortunately, a lot of the holiday plants are toxic. Yep. Um, lilies are toxic. Poinsettias mm -hmm. can be caustic. And the, and, I received the poinsettias. That's yep. what I... Um, and there's, there are usually, uh, <laughs> there's no good way of doing it other than making it unaccessible, either up on a high shelf where the, uh, where the animals can't reach it. But even the leaves, if the leaves fall the leaves, off, and even if they yep. eat the dead leaf, that can be toxic that can as well. That be problematic, oh, absolutely. I mean, because this happened, that was like a, a $900 vet pill. Absolutely. So, I mean, I hate to say it, but if you have, you know, lots of animals who like to eat lots of things, sometimes the artificial plants, you know, the artificial point set is, he's terrible. He's terrible. I'm about to have to buy a microphone, I'm afraid. <laughs> okay, just a few more things because we have to wrap is um, avoid, uh, keep, keep the alcohol away from the Absolutely. pants. Absolutely. Um, and just, and watch. <laughs> oh my gosh, the look I just received. I, know. <laughs> I didn't watch the food. Chocolates, raisins, grapes, a lot of the things that you want to make sure if they are in certain foods. Because yes, all right. I'm and probably gonna... one of the most important things, give your cats and dogs a safe place to go hide because it gets crazy on the holidays and you want to give them a safe place to go go relax and, and be calm. <laughs> like him, obviously. He is crazy. Okay, so for more information on pet care services, you can check out the Clay Humane website. Is Yoda up for adoption? He will be. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> Good luck with that. I know, exactly. <laughs> We're posting the link on the morning show page <laughs> on newsmorechecks.com. And don't forget to check out the pet section for a list of pets up for adoption.